really cool. Well, hello, retro game players. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Marcus. We're checking out Ikaruga on the Sega Dreamcast. This is an insane shooter, um, which is really fun to play, but pretty dang tough. Uh, I'm playing off of that one um, shooter multi-pack disc, which is really interesting. That's uh, I show that in the last Dreamcast video of uh, Zero Gun or Two. So check that out if you want. Uh, this one is really crazy. Uh, I'm, gonna, I, I'm tempted to go easy, but I won't. I'm going to go normal. I don't know what that is saying to me, so I'll choose the first option. Um, got three credits. That's not very much for this. Basically, what you do is you hit this button here, the blue one, to toggle between either like red or blue shields. Um, and yeah, basically you're safe and you can absorb, you'll see what I mean. So right now I'm toggling, there we go, there we go. You just don't want to be using the wrong, uh, color when absorbing the bullets, otherwise you die. So it's really interesting. You have to basically toggle and it can be really, really tough. So I'll see how far I can get. And I kind of forget what happens too, but at some point you, uh, I know I have like a power attack, kind of like a bomb that happens. See, I'm switching now. Ooh. There we go. It says chain status. I'm actually not sure what all that does for me. Uh, uh, oh, I toggled like too many times. Okay. Uh, switch. Oh, shit. Dude. Oh, <laughs> God. I can't believe I made it through that. Whoa. Nice. Oh my god, this game is amazing. Oh. Oh, what's going on? Oh. This is so gnarly, dude. And it's so cool to have the screen just fully vertical, you know. No refuge, okay. Controller's like vibrating like crazy. Oh yeah, I remember this dude. Dude, so brutal. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh no. Okay, I'll switch. Here we go. I'm not sure if I'm, when I'm, damn it, if I'm targeting, if I should be using my bombs on which color, you know, like the powered up thing, I don't, I don't really know. Oh. Oh. Jesus, dude. This game just keeps you freaking... Oh, I don't think this is going to be a very long video. <laughs> oh, man. Nice. There we go. Damn. 
think that must have been carrying a nuclear bomb. Max zero chain. I guess I'm not doing. I gave me a C. Give me a C. Hmm. Oh, fuck. That was stupid. Oh, uh, what? Did I crash into a ship? I didn't see the bullet back there. Dude, that is so fucked. Unbelievable. Why? Oh, is it? What's going on? Is it still playing? It says... Oh, cool. I guess I got... I got something. Oh, I switched in the middle of that stupid thing. Chapter 2. So this is the beginning? I think that's the intro to Chapter 2. Talk about cinematic. God. It's incredible. Oh my god, dude. Whoa, another one? Oh, oh my god. I like the way the red ship looks better. It just looks so awesome. Cool. Oh, 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 man. No! What was I supposed to do? What? Oh, that's it. Well, you guys, there you go. I honestly, this is an example of when I wish I was playing longer, because this is so cool. Anyway, thanks for watching, you guys. I appreciate it. And uh, I do recommend this game, although that was brutal. And you can see the dynamics and how it's, you know, the play mechanics are really good. So, anyway, until next time, you know what to do. You keep that shit retro. Look at that. There are max five chains. So I did something right. I don't know. Keep that shit retro by playing your Sega Dreamcast and Ikaruga later on.